Hi, I am Atikur Rahman, an AWS Certified Solution Architect. Today, I am going to show you how to create an instance in AWS and connect to that instance. So, I will go through very basic options and then show how a, a beginner can connect to the uh, instance and then continue his operations. So, let's get started. First, I am in the home page of AWS after login. So, I go to EC2, type EC2 here, then I <coughs> go to EC2. In the EC2 dashboard, I will see how many instances are there available. At this moment, there is zero instance running. Uh, I am in Ireland region, so you can choose your region, whatever it's nearest to you. Then uh, I click on launch instance. Launch instance uh, first. There are a lot of options to choose the OS family. The first family that <coughs> I prefer is the Amazon Linux because it's maintained by Amazon. So I select 64-bit Amazon Linux. Then I choose T2 Micro, it's inside the free tier, so we will be not charged within our free tier. Then we go to the next, the instance details, I select everything that is as default. Number of instances is one, VPC is default, and then placement group, that's not selected. I am role not required at this moment. Shutdown behavior, it's stop. then enable termination protection i choose yes because we wanted to protect accidental termination and then i go to the next i choose uh, 8 gigs of dixi space with general purpose ssd gp2 with ebs that's okay i go to next i add a tag here uh, so it's project start this is uh, for my channel AWS. So let's get started. Then it comes the security options. It's your virtual firewall. So uh, you can define whether who can get your instance and on which port. So on port 22, you need to give your access. I choose uh, my IP for port 22. And then uh, I go to the next option. That is HTTP. It goes everywhere. And then HTTPS. So, uh, port 22 only I can access. Port 80, this is for public HTTP, HTTPS, it's everywhere. Then I go to the next review. Before launching the instance, you have option to review it. So let's review everything. If all fine, then we click on launch. So uh, we choose a new key pair. Then we give the name. Today is 27 March 2019. So I just download the key pairs. It's downloaded. And then I click launch instance. Voila, the instance is launching so great news go to view instance to see my new instance yeah it's been initializing so i give a name new instance then i have downloaded the pm file so let's go to my shell i'm in download so we need to give a permission ch mode zero four zero zero Seven PM. Okay, let's see if our instance is up and running. Yeah, it's up. So I copy the IP. This is the IP. So let's connect to the instance. SSH. I. PM file name. Then EC2 user. Type of. I paste the IP address. So let's try to connect to the instance. Yes. Wow, we have connected to the newly created instance. It's uh, it's showing that it's Amazon Linux AMI. That's correct, and we have two packages to update. So uh, I think the users of this video it's just to show how easily you can create a new instance. It's less than ten minutes. 
and you can how easily connect to the instance and then continue your next stage of operations this is my first video on aws my plan is to create more videos on aws i am an aws certified solution architect associate so um i want to share my knowledge on aws to everyone uh, so that average uh, people get connected to aws and uh, use the benefit of aws if you like this video give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i uh, i want i i wish you to uh, happy coding on aws thanks for watching this video bye